Tomorrow is Veterans Day, and here in New York, there's a week-long celebration honoring brave men and women. There are two ships in New York Harbor right now carrying hundreds from the Navy, Marines, and Coast Guard. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor was there for a special ceremony today. Today is the 247th birthday of the United States Marine Corps. <laughs> The Secretary of the Navy was on board the USS Arlington for the cake cutting ceremony. This is a homecoming for the 22 year Navy veteran. I came to New York City as a refugee from Cuba in uh, 1962. Grew up in the Big Apple, uh, first in Hell's Kitchen and then later on in Astoria, Queens. And uh, I was accepted to Thomas Alva Edison High School in Jamaica, Queens, and then uh, went off to the Naval Academy. 600 service members arrived via the U.S. Coast Guard cutter Lawrence Lawson and the USS Arlington. I'm back in my city and like all the love that people are giving you, like it's, it's so great. I've actually been admiring the United States Navy right from my childhood and it's like a dream come true. I just like the idea of serving my country and doing something greater. The amphibious assault ship just completed a seven-month deployment to Europe. We got a tour, which included explosive ordnance disposal marines helping us try on the bomb suits. It's 94 pounds, not easy to walk in. We also got a robot demonstration. The USS Arlington here is the third ship of the Navy named for Arlington, Virginia, which is where the Pentagon is, the crash site of American Airlines Flight 77 on 9-11. We have some steel and some limestone from the Pentagon when it was hit. 9-11 and the events that happened afterwards, it's, it's really hallowed ground for us. And, and uh, so it's always a privilege to come here. New Yorkers are the best. These proud sailors and Marines, they serve our nation. And we have a responsibility to support them in every possible way. We honor your sacrifice and service. Happy Veterans Day! On the Hudson River, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. <laughs> So much pride, and the city's big Veterans Day parade is tomorrow. You can see a map of the parade routes and a list of street closures at cbsnewyork.com.